Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a vlog. If you'd like to see this vlog and see what I got up to today, please keep watching. So today I am going out for the first time this year. I've been down with the flu since Christmas Day, so I've virtually done nothing. I've spent no money in the last three weeks, so today I'm going to go and hit the shops and see what sale bargains there might be left. There might be nothing left. But I did get a little email from Debenham's Beauty Club card to say that I've got a little birthday treat to get my brows done at Benefit. And then I'm going to have a quick nosy round and see what's left in the sale. First up, I've just arrived at the Glasgow Post Office collection point because I've missed a parcel. How I've missed a parcel, I don't know because I've been at home all day every day for the last three weeks so maybe the postman came when it was in the bathroom or anything but i'm going to go and collect this now it says it's a silver packet i'm quite excited because i've not ordered anything so i wonder what it is it's a mask from image skincare i am so looking forward to trying this, this is exactly what i need right now after having the flu so i've just arrived at the silver burn and look how gorgeous the sky is today, it's absolutely beautiful. Um, so I'm going to try and film as much as I possibly can and less filming of my feet, but it's going to be really difficult, especially when you're out in a public place. Okay, I've just arrived in the mall. I'm just going to go straight to and see if Benefit can do my brows. If not, I'll just go to the bathroom and I'll fill them in myself. to find the benefit counter which I think is up the back here somewhere. I absolutely love Devon's beauty department. It's just so clean and easy to shop around. I see benefit there through here. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully they might be able to see me. Skin's going to be a wee bit more sensitive to heat and everything so no problem, just reload the fine. cast of that just to temperature test. It's just to make sure that you feel the wax, it's not too warm on your skin or anything. How does that I really feel? like the wax in Benefit. It's like it's kind of like paralysed looking, isn't it? Skin. Well, that's good. So what I'll do is I'm going to grab a pencil. We're going to do a wee brow map together, okay? Just perfect. so that I'm getting the right shape, the right colour, and everything. Okay. Colour wise, so you like to go a bit darker with a light brown. Yeah. But okay. if that's a wee bit light, all I'm... so all we do is we go for the thinnest point in your nose. This is where your eyebrows should start. Go for the pupil of your eye. This is where your eyebrows. This wee point should be where the front of your eyebrow is, this should be where your arch is, and that would be where your end is. So when I'm waxing, I'm going to kind of follow that shape. Wow. <laughs> so this is going to stay on for two minutes, yeah? Two minutes. No, I think that colour's come up quite well. So if you keep your eye closed for me, just going to do a wee wax in the middle. Let me see the um, your right, this one's just kind of thicker. Your skin feels so soft. Much. I'm actually filling in three or four pieces. Okay, so with every tint or wax that you get done at Benefit Cosmetics, you get a free mini Give Me Brow. So now done, I'm just going to take a little wander around the shops and see if there's any last minute bargains to be had. I'm not looking for makeup because I've got too much makeup. I'm just going to go and see what's in Zara, maybe River Island, and what other shops are out there. I'm going to go into Oasis, they have got 70% off. So I found a couple of pieces in Oasis that I quite like. A pair of white skinny denims. They are only £12 and this little pony shirt. Okay, so I think this top is going to be, have to be one of these ones that I'm going to give a miss and I'm going to give the denims a miss as well because they are just too long and they just look silly all turned up like this so 
It's a mess in Oasis for me. So I'm just making my way to Superdrug now because the sale in Zara was a bit of a disaster. They didn't really have anything nice and it was just reels and reels of junk. But every time I've tried to film this, there's been someone that sort of walked past in my video and I'm trying my hardest to make sure that I don't get DM my video or anybody's faces or anything. Very, very difficult. So I'm giving up um, looking at clothes in the shops. I'm just going to make my way to Superdrug and see if they've got this shellac moving kit, which is Superdrug's own brand, which I've heard is very, very, very good. I just need to make my way and find their accessories. I've seen somebody use these cotton roll pads on Instagram. I'm going to give them a try. I can't remember who it was that I've seen using them, but I'm going to try these. I think this might be the right section here. Was it that there? It might be actually. I don't even know if it's gel polish, but I don't know if that's the actual thing that's on it. Yeah, I think it might be actually. I've heard it's like foil. I don't know if there's stuff actually in it or you need to purchase the actual stuff. I think I've got everything that I need. I've got the foil wrap, I've got the artificial nail remover, and I've also got the little cuticle sticks for removing this polish. I do, yes. My first purchase at the mall today, Super Drug. Just all nail products for removing shellac nail varnish. And I'm now just coming into Marks and Spencers and I'm just going to pick up a few bits and pieces. Hi, Elizabeth. Yeah, I'm fine for a bag, thanks. Thank you. Uh, there's not really much happening in the mall. Sorry if this vlog has not been quite what you have expected it to be today. I feel like it's been quite a boring one and a really unsuccessful shopping trip. I'm back home now. I've put all my shopping away. I'm just going to have some lunch just now. It is, it's 10 to 2. So I'm just going to have some bread and olives and a wee cup of tea. And then I'm going to try and get this shellac nail varnish off with the stuff that I got in Super. Lunch, really simple. A couple of pieces of chia butter bread with some olive oil and olives and a little bit of rock salt. Let's get these shellac nails off now. I've got the foil wraps and I've got the artificial nail remover rather than the shellac nail remover because they didn't have any in Superdrug at the time. So it says here we need to scuff the surface of the polished nail, apply the nail polish remover to the absorbent pad, securely wrap the foil around the finger and nail and soak for a maximum of 20 minutes. Okay, so these are the pads I've got. Oh, a bit too much there. Okay, so that's the absorbent pad. I'm going to wrap that around my fingers. Finish this hand and then relax for 20 minutes. I don't understand why there's 24 in a pack. So we've got 10 fingers. So really it should really have been 20 for two applicants or even 30 so you can get use of it three times out of the one box. Oh, yeah, that's coming off quite easy, look. <laughs> quite happy with that. It's getting dark now, the sun is starting to go down. I'm going to end this vlog here, but I will be back tomorrow with my thoughts on the Image Skincare Mask, which I'm really excited to use. I wish I could use it tonight, but because I've just had my brows done, I will use it tomorrow and I will see you tomorrow. Hello, so it's actually been two days since I filmed that previous part of the video. I wanted to give my brows a couple of days to recover from the waxing. So I'm now going to try out the Image Skincare Biomecular Hydrating Recovery Mask. Now it says you leave this on for 20 to 25 minutes, so I'm just going to put that on now. Oh goodness. Just need to, okay, here we go. I'm just going to leave this on for the full 25 minutes. I'm going to go and lie down and relax, set a timer on my phone. But it feels really nice. It actually feels like having a really nice gel, cool gel pack all over. I've had the mask on now for 25 minutes and it's it's kind of like, it's absorbed right into my skin, which is really nice. It makes my skin under here feel really tight and luscious, actually. I'm just going to take it off now. Made my skin feel plumper and juicier. So I'm just going to wait for that to soak into my skin. Um, maybe give it about half an hour and then I'm going to put my makeup That's on. That's the mask done and my makeup on now. I'm really, really impressed with the mask. It's made my skin really plump and soft and very, very, very hydrated. I hope you enjoyed this video. 
And if you'd like to see more videos from me, leave me a comment below. Um, I'd love you to subscribe and hit that bell button so that you know you'll get some notifications from me. And don't forget, you can also follow my blog, which is thisgirllikestoshop.com. And I'm also on Instagram at thisgirllikestoshop. Till the next video, guys. Bye-bye.